Avast, me hearties. Rock Hall's been invaded by pirates. It's the annual Pirates and Wenches Fantasy Weekend when the Bayside the Yachting Town plays host to the notorious the Sailors of the Caribbean in Chesapeake. Ha it all has to do with Greybeard the pirate and the search for treasure he buried somewhere in the area. The fact that Greybeard is mythical, unless you happen to live in Rock Hall, doesn't diminish the fun. There is music, of course. Traditional songs by Pirates for Sale. And while researching the history of that shanty, they found an earlier version. Listen closely. Just sit right back and you'll hear a tale, a tale of a faithful trip that started from this tropic on aboard this tiny ship. The mate was a mighty sail and man, the skipper brave and four. Five passengers and sail that day for a three-hour tour. A three-hour tour before the three-hour just as Civil War reenactors have living history, so do pirates. Jan Golden explains what happens when the pirates came ashore. You had to get provisions, you had to get water. So, uh, and when you were on shore and you had to work on the ship, and so everybody would encamp and you'd have, uh, sometimes you'd have women. Mostly the men, they did the carrying of the water and bring it back to camp and cooking and getting provisions ready for going back out to sea. And why would someone like Chris Brown, with a normal life as a biology teacher, spend his weekends living like a pirate? I uh, really, when I thought back on it, it's like, why didn't I do this before? I've been obsessed with pirates for a long time. I remember writing graffiti on a desk in college, a chemical oceanography course. I don't want to be here, I want to be a pirate. You know, it just all of a sudden, it clicked with me. I was approaching retirement. What do I want to do when I'm done? This is what I want to do. I want to be a pirate. <laughs> there are craft sellers, real kettle popcorn, and lots of pirate stuff for sale. But what's a pirate weekend without a sword fight? I'm Fran Severn, and this is another Delmarva Drives adventure. Arr!